what is up guys my name is kim and welcome to my channel if you are new to my channel make sure to like comment share and subscribe turn your little bell notifications on to get notified every time i do upload anyway guys i this is my second video um my first video on my personal channel because if some of you may not know i do have a channel with my boyfriend which is right here so make sure to go check that out as well but my own channel the first time that i've uploaded that the first time i uploaded on this channel was probably back in september September, which is quite some time we are in 2019 so that was left in 2018 and I wanted to be more consistent but I guess like I can't make up any excuses honestly because I even though I didn't have time I can make time so anyway guys so as you can see by the title of this video I'm doing a bougie on a budget Ulta edition I did a little shopping at Ulta uh, my boyfriend gave me a gift card and then I bought also some stuff before that and I left it in the bag with some of the things I've already used so excuse me for that but I was like you know what I'm gonna go ahead and just show them a little bit of what I get and you know how much it costs me because honestly some of it is really not expensive at all it's really like I would say it's in the it's in the budget um, for most of us because personally, even though I love makeup, I just don't think I have to get the most expensive makeup all the time. I feel like you know the makeup that I get does me really good, um, especially because I don't do a lot. But I do want to start getting into more doing like the contouring, the baking, all of that. So without further ado, let's start the video. Sorry about the bag as well, just because I just threw it in the back of my car. And I got some of the stuff out and then right now I was just like, oh my god, I don't have everything that I usually always get. But whatever, I was gonna have to do. So the first thing that I got I also was these eyelashes. These are the Kiss Lash Couture Triple Push-Up Collection. And honestly, these are literally like my favorite ones. If you guys don't see, I'm wearing them right now. Um I think these are where's the name oh it's um klcp07 if you guys want to go ahead and try them out i think these are very inexpensive i love the lily lashes and all of that but i just think these um do so like they're so bomb and they're just like i think they were ten dollars or if not ten dollars oh if it's not 10 i'm pretty sure they were like eight dollars and i think these are bomb for me like personally i love dramatic lashes and they're an expensive bitch so like why not because these will do you literally what you want them to do so these are the kiss couture lashes go check them out i love them i have them on right now again i'm going to show you guys i feel like they're so dramatic so why not and honestly the, these lashes last me about, I'm gonna say, they last me usually one to two months. But that's because I use this hair glue right here. And this hair glue, by the way, is $2.99 at your local beauty store, hair store, whatever. And I love it. Like, it literally doesn't make my eyes itch. Honestly, the adhesive, forgive me if I'm pronouncing it wrong, but I don't like that one. It makes my eyes swell up and it gives me like, uh, I don't know, but I love this one. It's so e easy to take off the freaking eyelash. Like, honestly, it's not even messy at all. It doesn't stain. Like, I literally can take it off right now, and it becomes a little ball, and then you just start away. So, that's my favorite one. And those lashes, I, like, I've always, I've used them ever since I was in, I'm gonna say I've used them for quite some time. Now. So, honestly, guys, try them out, and let me know what you guys think in the comments down below i love the lashes like i said coco lashes all of those lashes i've tried them before but i just feel like for me what works is this and that's just how it works. the next thing that i got in my bag is the la girl pro concealer in guys i honestly don't ever know what like number or like color it is i just get whatever one i always like i just take my other bottle and i'm just like okay this is the one but i think this is the in the color gc969 this is how you know i'm not a beauty girl but yeah this is the one that i get right here and as you can see it's very very light and here's the name of it if you guys want to see uh, i don't think it shows you guys but this is what i use to conceal the um underneath my eyes 
and I can feel like right here and then my eyelash like I'm not my eyelash underneath my eyebrow um, I like this. this is so inexpensive I think this was two to three dollars I think it was less than that and if you go to the beauty store like I got where I got my glue I think it was like two dollars so I don't know because you know how when they sell it at big companies you they have to make it a little more expensive because certain companies have to get like I don't know I don't know I'm not gonna even act like I know but anyway guys this is the one that I get in the LA Pro Girl this is like the best concealer that I've tried um I, I did try NARS I did try which other one did I try honestly I don't even know but this is the one that I use the most and it's very inexpensive so go check it out bitches now the next thing that I got was the Born This Way foundation and this is in natural beige so honestly this is my favorite foundation I've tried um, NARS I've tried which other one did I try I've tried the Too Faced BB Cream. I call it BB Cream, but I don't think it's called BB Cream. And I've tried MAC. I've tried all of them. And my favorite ones to this moment is this one, the Born This Way, and one from e.l.f. And I just love the way that it makes my skin look. It makes it look so, like, dewy. It makes it look, like, not dry, not too cakey. Like, literally, perfecto. Like, it literally goes on my face, like, Wah! and that's it. Like, I love it. So, this is one of my favorite foundations, and here it is. And like I said, it's in natural beige if you guys want to go ahead and try it. I think it works with skin that's like not too dry, not too like oily, if that makes sense. But this is my next item that I got, so here is like what it looks like on me because I'm wearing it right now. That's a second item that I got. And then a third item that I got was the Kylie Jenner. Um, lipstick and this is in the color oh, I don't even know guys oh exposed so I honestly love this lip kit it's so matte like it literally goes on like this other like liquid matte lipsticks like they take a little bit long to like stick onto my lips and this one goes just on right away so honestly like I, this is my first kind of lip kit I never really wanted to order it because when I did want to order it they were all sold out as you guys know and I was like, I'm not about to sit here and just wait forever. So then once they brought it to Ulta, I was like, bitch, I have to get this shit right now. And I got it. And here it is. So, uh, like I said, guys, I use most of these things. And I just love it so much. And it smells like chocolate. So, I mix it with my lipsticks. Item that I got, guys. Let me put the bag down because I have to tell you guys about this. So, I don't know if any of you ever tried the e.l.f. brushes, but bitch, let me just tell you guys right now, I fucking love these brushes so much. Excuse my language, but like no munches like these are literally like the shit. They're so inexpensive. They're like a dollar each or two dollars. Oh, excuse me and they are just so good they blend so well like honestly my makeup is fucked up today but they blend literally so so good and I just love all of them like I have the blending brush right here which is right here and it's elf oh why won't this focus all right I think you guys can see it right there and as you can see like this is what the brush looks like and it's so soft like the hair doesn't come off like I love Morphe brushes don't get me wrong I, I have them but this one like Morphe brushes kind of like the hair comes off this one doesn't and it's so soft and it goes in so well and then this one is the blending brush as well and I love this brush so much I have this one and I have <laughs> this one don't mind me it's kind of like dirty but this is the angled foundation brush and I love it as well as you can see I've used this so much so this is one of my favorite other ones and I have like so many of them like honestly this is my other favorite brush this is for mineral powder brush but I use it to like contour myself and like I said it's so soft and each of these cost me about like two to three dollars each so honestly girls like go check them out like they're so inexpensive they're so bomb they blend in so well I mean it might not look like it right through here because today I just rushed my makeup because I have so many things to do but these literally are the bomb like I love them so much I was when I came across them 
I was like, bitch, like I'm never using any other brush but these. Like as you can see, this one is another one that you contour your face with and I've used it a lot. So I'm gonna go get a new one. Um, but I've got, I've had these for about, this one I've had for a year now. All these I just got, but I'm gonna get a new one of these because they didn't have them the other day. And an Ulta, like they're so cheap. They're just so cheap and they're so worth it. If you're not looking to spend 20 to like 40 dollars for the brush set over and more fee like i get it like you know i'm so for the good quality but this is great quality for literally such a low price and i feel like so many people just kind of look at it like oh like it's elf and i don't look at it that way i love to try new things just because you never know so whatever fits you is whatever fits you don't let anybody tell you oh that shit is cheap because it's not okay my experience with it i loved it so I'm gonna just leave it there. So, <clears throat> the next thing that I got was the um, Butter Gloss from NYX. And this was like $5, I think. And this is in BLG 13. And I love this so much just because like, I don't know, it's just like, like, I don't know. But I love this lip gloss. I'm like, you know, on a day that you're not really wearing, you know, anything. It's like a cute little like pink color or whatever and it's so glossy so this is my other item that i picked up and honestly the rest of the things that i have in the bag they're mostly lipsticks because i think i got the makeup revolution um bronzer and i love it so much it smells so good it smells like peaches like i don't know how to explain it but it's so bomb like literally so bomb i seen it on another beauty guru's um makeup like haul or whatever and i bought it and it was like seven dollars like it was a green like a tropical like you know like little little container thing but i think i left it in my boyfriend's car because i was doing the makeup in there but that one's really really bomb as well so go look it up makeup revolution bronzer it's like seven dollars i believe and it's so good like i love it so much and last but not least like i said i bought a bunch of lippies like i just i don't know i'm so like obsessed and this is ridiculous because they literally spend money on a bunch of lip glosses and i never like stop using one so this is one of my favorites it's the nyx laundry gloss and this is in llg 06 butter and i love this lip gloss it's like so so good it's like it has this the like the nude color as you guys can see i don't know if you guys can see really well but i love it so much like i'm gonna just keep mixing shit i don't know why but i love this lip gloss like lip gloss like it's so bomb and i got the same one but in the why is it the oh this is the ll g05 sable and this one is so good too it's like a new like peachy color which i love too like if i'm not wearing a lipstick then i wear this and then i got the boxum one and oh yeah by the way guys these were probably like seven dollars i believe they're for sure seven dollars so i got two of them three actually and then the boxum one i don't think it's that expensive honestly i think 20 dollars. i think it is like i always honestly just buy things without looking at the prices but for this bougie on a budget video i had to look at the prices and i meant to like give like show you guys my receipts show you guys how much i spend but i lost it so but the box one i just don't think it's that expensive like i think it's so worth it it's like 20 dollars, and it's so glossy it makes your lips look so like juicy and you know like so i like it so much i think it's worth it and i don't usually restock on it for like a whole month and a half like i don't use it as much um only when i'm like really going out then i'll use it but other than that that's why the nyx lingerie ones are really good but i really do love this box one and this one's in the white russian so if you guys want to go ahead and take a look at it i love this one so much now the other nyx lingerie one that i got was a shimmer chatoyant i don't understand that but it's in the lls09 mason so this is like a brown color with a, like a lot of lot of like shimmer and i really really like this one 
And last but not least, I um, stocked up on a lot of the ColourPop matte lipsticks. I love them so much. That's what I was wearing before I put all this lip gloss on. And this is in the Beeper 18 G5. This is one of my favorites. My friend Elaine put me onto them and I was like, bitch, like I'm never gonna stop using these. These are so good and inexpensive. They're $7, I mean, why not? If you're not trying to buy the light, the Kylie lip kit, here you go. And I just really, really love this one. So if you guys want me to go ahead and swatch it out, I will, just so you guys can take a look at it or whatever. So this is the Beeper. This is the Kylie Exposed. This is the NYX lingerie one, the like the peachy nude color that I was telling you guys about. And this is the nude one um, that I was telling you guys about. Oh. I'm just gonna go ahead and swatch it out for you guys really quick just so you guys can take a look at it. So guys, this is what it looks like right here. The first one is the Beeper in um, ColourPop. The next one above that is the Kylie Exposed. Then the next one after that is the NYX Lingerie, the peachy color look that I told you guys. The next one above that one is the NYX Lingerie nude color. And then this one is the Boxum. So, ladies, I personally like all of them. Oh, the camera's not trying to focus. Come on. Alright, guys. So, yeah. So, I was saying, honestly, Ulta has everything which I love Ulta for. Like, Sephora is good, but it has all, like, the high-end brands. They're not, like, they don't have, like, the NYX, the e.l.f. or any of that, which I don't like because, like I said, I'm a big, like, you know, like, I love e.l.f. I love trying all of those products. So, check them out and make sure to give this video a huge thumbs up and get ready for the next video. I'm going to be doing story times, hauls, thrift shop, like, thrift shopping, all of that. So, make sure you guys stay tuned and thank you so much for watching this video. And I hope everyone has a very, very successful new year. Make this 2019 your best year and make sure you keep grinding make sure you keep striving to be you know like at the top and make sure you keep uplifting your friends so thank you so much for watching and i hope you guys enjoyed this video bye